Columbus police tonight are investigating dozens of reports of cars being vandalized in German Village. Two days ago, cars in Clintonville were also targeted in what appears to be the same type of crime. Now residents are left to foot the bill. NBC4's Tyler Carter is live in Clintonville with more on this story. Tyler. Yeah, Katie, and as I found out, it can be an expensive bill. This car here in, German, in Clintonville was targeted. The scratch starting from the back of the car all the way to the front of the car. I spoke with the body shop, and they tell me a scratch like this can cost any car owner between $500 to $2,000. Clintonville residents woke up to a not so pleasant surprise Sunday. Uh, so I came out to take a look at it and found a black streak across the, the driver's side door. Justin Goodwin says his neighbor told him to come outside quick because his car had been vandalized. To his surprise, his other neighbors were also outside and stunned by the damage done to their cars. It ran from about here back to here across both doors. With a little bit of WD-40 and some elbow grease, he was able to get it off, but others weren't as fortunate. According to CPD, nearly 70 cars were vandalized in Clintonville. Dark cars, keyed, and light-colored cars were spray-painted. I'm making a point of parking my car in the garage from now on, though. Steve's black Subaru was keyed. Now he's left with a bill he never asked for. And I've got a $500 deductible on my policy, so he said they pay anything over $500, but I'm stuck with $500 at least anyways. Just south of Clintonville, more than a dozen German village residents were hit. This happened this morning. Police think it was the same people who did it. I mean, I was shocked. There was purple paint all down the side of my car. Elizabeth Osborne was on her way to work when she noticed her car was spray painted. She was able to clean it off and says this was not the best way to start off a Tuesday. Now, Columbus police say they don't have any suspects on who did this vandalism here in Clintonville and also in German Village, but they are asking anyone that has a home surveillance on their houses to please turn it into CPD. Local for you in Clintonville, Tyler Carter, NBC4. All right, Tyler, thank you.